you and I were laying in the moonlight Dreaming about the places we've been all night Wishing for our secrets to unfold We just need somebody to hold Somebody to hold Hey, what is up everybody and thank you so much for watching this video. Today in this video I'm going to teach you how you can screen mirror your iPhone to another iPhone. So, in this video I'm going to be using my iPhone XS Max on the right and iPhone and my iPhone 10 on the left. So, if you're running any older iPhone devices, this should work, but as long as your iPhone is updated to iOS 11 or above, it, this should work. But if you're running iOS 10 or even 9, it's going to be hard, but well, so also, if you're running iPhone 11 Pro Max, just make sure your iPhone is updated to, to the 13.1. Uh, it's because there are tons of bugs in there. I'm gonna fix the bugs and uh, also it'll be smooth. The first thing you wanna do is unlock your iPhone, of course, and just go to settings. Now, if you're running an you know, old device, this kind of feels different because the control panel will from the, uh, will be on the bottom, uh, unlike the iPhone 10 or even iPhone 10s Max or 11 Pro. Any in this in that case, it should be on the top. Go to control settings and go to co uh, the control panel settings. Go to control customization and just make sure you uh, you have screen recording on the top uh, on the control panel it should not be there by default so just click on the green uh, plus uh, green plus icon on the right uh, left side this should put the uh, recording option on the uh, control panel as you can see i'm running the ios 13 with the dark mode so don't worry about that it's it's all the same the icon might be different because it's kind of a smaller compared to the iphone 12's a bit larger so don't get confused by it I mean, I'm not sure it's gonna gonna confuse anybody, anyways. So the second thing you want to do, just make sure you have internet connection, and uh, if you're not right, if you don't have any Wi-Fi connection nearby, I'll show you how you can do it without the Wi-Fi too. So just go to the control center. It, by the way, uh, warning uh, the, because this might eat your data. Uh, the uh, so you, you might want to just save your data for the uh, for the social and stuff, you know, social media and stuff. Just go to the mobile data and turn on the mobile data. Once you turn on the mobile data, to go back to the uh, go back to the settings and just go to the personal hotspot settings and just turn on the hotspot. Also, once you turn on the hot hotspot, just make sure you have a correct name for your hotspot and the correct password because you don't want people to be connected to your iPhone and eat your data. Once you do that, uh, it's pretty easy from here. I mean, a few steps in there, but it's pretty easy. So you want to do is download an app, free app called A Power Mirror. I'll be, uh, uh, I'll be, I'll be having a link in the description box below, right below the like button. Just open the app. It's pretty simple. All you want to do is just press that blue button on the bottom. That should scan the iPhone. But before you do that, just make sure your iPhone, the, both your iPhones, are running on same network. So if you're running on, a, if you're using the Wi-Fi, just make sure your iPhone is connected to the same Wi-Fi. But if you're running Hotspot, you don't have to worry about it because it's obviously the same. Once you click on it, it will show you that there's an iPhone XS Max, and then on my iPhone XS Max screen, it will show you there's an iPhone 10. If you wanna, it's it works both ways. So I'm gonna show you how to do it with uh, my iPhone XS Max because it's a bigger screen. It'll be pretty cool to see it on a smaller iPhone 10. So what you wanna do is click on the QR code on the top right corner. I'm sorry about the uh, slow device. I don't know what what happened, but iOS 12 seems to be having problems. Once you click on it and just click on the QR code, but not on your other device. It should say scan. So. All you want to do is just scan your iPhone uh, QR code. It will take few few seconds, not even few seconds, like one or one second or two, depending on how fast your internet connection is. Once you scan the QR code, I will show you some instructions. So what you want to do now on your uh, on your big iPhone, on your other iPhone, in this case, I uh, on my iPhone XS Max, go to Control Panel and just. 3D touch the uh, screen recording. Oh, by the way, if you're not, if you're running iPhone 11 Pro, just hold because there's no 3D touch in there. And also, just click on a power mirror and start broadcasting. It will take three seconds, but when you 
when it's done, it will automatically screen mirror your iPhone, in this case iPhone XS Max to iPhone 10. It will be just as smooth after a few seconds because it will take a few seconds to just, like, you know, just get it ready. Also, if you want to uh, do it, like, right there, there are tons of options in there, but all you want to, all you can do is rotate and cancel the screen. So it will take a few seconds to actually get, uh, get the, uh, get this thing running, but with time it will get smooth. With, like, it will take probably 10 to 15 seconds in this in my case it took about 20 seconds i mean i was downloading some stuff you know and the ios was updating on the iphone 10 but after that it will it, will, it won't take much it will, it will probably take about 20 seconds to just smooth things up also you can do tons of stuff you can watch videos you can you, you might be asking what what's the uh, benefit of this well it could be a prank, but also it could be just you don't want to lend someone your phone. I mean, you don't want to give it to someone else. I mean, if you want to show it, to, if you want to show something to them, just scream or iPhone to their, their iPhone and just show it to them instead of just giving their, giving them your phone. Well, that's pretty cool. Thank you so much for watching. And also, if you lock your phone, it's gonna cancel the whole process. So you have to do everything, everything again. But just putting it out there. I hope you liked the video and uh, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please subscribe to the channel because I'll be uploading tons more videos just like these. Again, thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.